Recently, Kurdor District in Kintera City held a ceremony to announce the export of 1.2 tons of longan to the U.S. This successful export to demanding markets opens up promising opportunities for local farmers. A good market leads to higher selling prices, thereby increasing income for growers. Longan farmers will be assured and motivated to do their best to continuously improve the quality of their products. Export standard longan requires farmers to meet stringent requirements, but they manage to comply. The linkage with export enterprises ensures high selling prices for cooperatives and associations. The fruit must have a higher rate of acceptance and a sweeter taste. For export, the fruit must be cut leaving a stem of about 2 to 3 centimeters. This requires more labor and higher costs, but the selling price is higher. With its thick flesh, moderate sweetness, large size, and low water content, this longan is highly favored in markets such as the U.S., Australia, and Canada. In addition to exporting fresh fruit, export enterprises also freeze longan to supply international markets year-round. Since the start of the season, we have exported nearly 20 tons of longan to markets such as the U.S. and Australia. Currently, global demand exceeds supply. Therefore, when there is a large harvest, we freeze the fruit for both sea and air transport. Frozen longan is then sold year-round to meet continuous demand. The district exports around 250 tons of longan annually. Exporting longan yields higher profits compared to domestic consumption. Kinteris is a major source of longan exports in the Mekong Delta region. For over five years, Longan from the city has been officially exported to international markets.